Hi there, Joka here from A Pocket Full of Happiness and in this video I'm going to be focusing on the new Love is in the Air um, die set but I will also be using bits and pieces from other sets. These are the colors I'm going for today um, and I am trying to use the Falling Hearts background stamp that is also new for my background. Um, at least on one of the cards and this is the um, first time I actually use the stamp set so I am kind of priming it with um, an eraser just so that the um, ink uh, doesn't pull up on it if that makes sense um, and then I am double stamping it to you know to have a better result but I was not sure what color I actually want my background to be, so I am um, now stamping a red one as well. And as you can see, um, the first stamped image is not perfect, but the second one is already um, good. So um, yeah, um, now I am going to try which one I want uh, for my background. And I already did the die cutting um, off camera and as you can see the balloon you can just use a single color or you can use um, four uh, colors you can um, layer this on the background that is also a separate die so it's easy to assemble it and um, I created uh, a little envelope with a love letter inside and the balloon is going to um you know deliver this little message uh i didn't i don't know i i thought that it didn't quite stand out so much and so i actually went back to the light pink and i'm also using flowers from the spring floral and this one here is an old um fun stampers journey embossing folder uh, this design is actually available from spellbinders i think um i hope it's not very dis like not disturbing but like um i cannot find the word that i'm looking for right now um but i hope it's, it doesn't bother you that i use some other products from other companies because basic things like embossing folders i don't have and i do like some texture in my background so anyway long story short <laughs> um so i'm assembling my first card here it's super simple and it comes together uh, very quickly as you can see there are more parts to this die set and um I will show you some examples at the end of the video that I already created before. Um, I did not have a time. I did not have time back then to make a video as well, but I will show you the cards. Maybe that gives you some other ideas. And uh, yeah, I'm now adding the sentiment that also comes with this set. And then this uh, card is almost done only my favorite things are missing from it which you know it's uh, enamel dots uh, so I will pull out some in um, you know in colors that work uh, with it and I kind of like uh, this light pink that doesn't really stand out that much from the background it's just an additional a different kind of texture there Okay, uh, moving on to the other one. So for this one, I um, embossed the background with the little hearts. And this one is an older set, uh, the stitched hearts. And I'm just using the two smaller sizes, I think, or maybe three sizes, actually. And I folded them or kind of folded them in half. Um, and this is the other part of the the this um love is in the air set this is a basket that you can also hang on the balloon and then there's another uh part to the die that i did not use in this video but you will see in the 
previous cards. Now this one here, Love Love Heart, is also a new die set, and I just used the love word because I already had that die cut for another project that I don't, didn't use it for, so I wanted to use it. And I noticed that I started gluing down the hearts here and then kind of lost track. I actually really liked the way it looked. And now that I took off some of the hearts, I didn't remember how they were and I'm struggling. So this happens all the time. And yeah, the <laughs> in the end, it just didn't look the same and the, I didn't quite like it as much, but it is what it is. So I'm kind of just creating a, you know, a lot of, a bunch of balloons there for a different look. So just so, you know, to give you an idea that you can uh, mix and match your new and old stash. And I think probably everybody has some kind of heart dies in, uh, in their stash. So, yeah, I thought that was, uh, you know, uh, a good idea to, to use something so basic here. Okay, so um, obviously you see that I used a variety of uh, different um, pink cardstock here. But I think it would be super cute from, um, you know, different rainbow colors or, or whatever. Uh, so many different options. Okay, so th that's all there is to this card. Uh, I didn't even add an enamel dots, to my surprise. <laughs> okay, so here are the two cards, and then I'm gonna quickly show you the um, the other two that I already created before for my boys, actually. So these will have a bit uh, more of a masculine color theme, maybe. Um, yeah, so and the clouds are from the Rainbow Circle, uh, also a new die set. So I hope this gives you a few new ideas. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.